Hello my friends, how are you all from my channel Voicom Means Truth? My name is Peter, for all of you that do not know me just yet Maybe I'm gonna reach a new segment of uh, you people out there Not my uh, regular watcher, subscribers, someone else Because now I'm talking about Ronaldo Ronaldo, Cristiano Ronaldo Proud Christian Cristiano Ronaldo is an honor to talk about him on this channel as on this channel as you know I am honoring God more than anything else then I'm doing breaking news then I stand for what I know is right without uh, catering to people or to people's opinions I'm not interested in that I'm interested in the truth because the truth is what sets us free the music that you hear is from my friend David Lastra. His channel is another but deep instrumental. So if you want this kind of music that will touch your heart deeply, you know what to do. You go on YouTube, you type in their search bar, deep instrumental, and then loads and loads of good music pops up. David Lastra produces music all the time. But now let's go back to what I want to talk about. Cristiano Ronaldo, proud Christian, courageous. He is now in Saudi Arabia. He is closing his career there. And uh, he is not ashamed to do the sign of the cross in a country that uh, forbids 100% any manifestations of Christianity. Ronaldo is not afraid to show to all the world that he is crucifix. He is wearing it at his neck. Is doing the sign of the cross because he is Ronaldo and because he is so much loved in Saudi Arabia he can get away with it <laughs> anyway what I want to show to you right now is a short clip Cristiano Ronaldo posted this in his Twitter I don't know much about it but in his Twitter he said help me find this man so uh, I'm doing my part I will help Cristiano Ronaldo. <laughs> I'm not sure how I can help him as I am here in the United Kingdom. But the power of the internet is amazing. I can uh, outreach to the ends of the world. Do I have anyone from Saudi Arabia that is watching this channel? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe. I'm just a small name anyway. Just roughly 6,000 plus subscribers. That's nothing. If I were to have 100,000 upwards, then we can talk about something. Even that 100,000 subscriber is just small potatoes on YouTube. <laughs> anyway, let me show it to you this video. It's a short video with a man, a middle-aged man. He looks about maybe late 50s, maybe early 60s. He's taking a picture with his phone. And Ronaldo said, please help me find this man. If Ronaldo says it, then we will listen. <laughs> so take a look at this little video and what do you think? Comment in the comment section. And again, if uh, there are new people that will come and see this video, I appreciate your comments, either positive or maybe, maybe you have negative comments, whatever. Anyway, take a look and see and tell me, do you know this man? Three, two, one. <laughs> so my friend this was the video a very short video indeed Ronaldo posted it on Twitter not long time ago uh, about four hours ago on his uh, Twitter account and by chance I bumped into it <laughs> I have Twitter and Twitter is good because it helps you as a creator to see the videos that are trending so this was trending with 25 million views already well it's about Cristiano Ronaldo after all he is a massive uh, mega star uh, very much loved and he deserves of this he worked so hard to get where he is today he is a true 
star. He has no prima donna attitude. He is kind and genuine. And what's more important, he believes in Christ. He is a Christian and he's not, he's not afraid to show that he is a Christian. He loves children. <laughs> he's, <laughs> good. <laughs> he's a good man. Man that uh, deserves all our respect and love. And um, I wish him that he will have always in his life genuine people that love him for who he is, not because he is Cristiano Ronaldo, not because he is super mega rich, not because he is super mega successful, not because wherever he goes people are literally shouting his name, wanting to take a picture with him. <laughs> Imagine how he managed to keep himself humble in the midst of all this craziness. To be uh, famous destroys many friends. I can make a, a good list with people that have been destroyed by this fame. Starting with Elvis Presley, Alanis Morinette. Uh, she's uh, as well battling battles of life. Janis um, Joplin, there was this uh, lady here in United Kingdom with a deep voice, powerful voice uh, from Camden Town. What was her name? I forgot. <laughs> Let me know if you know who I'm talking about. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, guys. I appreciate you. And tell me, do you know who that man is? <laughs> Let me know. God bless you all. Love you, friends.